Howdy everybody, it's Resonator Zen here. You know it would be a really fun thing to do is get a really hardcore Christian, get a really hardcore Scientologist, and get a really hardcore, um, I think his name is like Xenaliast or something. It's this weird people that think that it's the same thing as uh, creation just with aliens. Have those three in a room. Basically, I think that might be Scientology. I'm not exactly sure. I haven't looked it up. But have those three people, if they are indeed three different groups, have those three people <laughs> in a room, lock them in the room, and have them discuss their theories for the creation of the universe. Just, I mean, really hardcore Christian, really hardcore Scientology, even really car hardcore guy who thinks that same creation story as the Bible, just with aliens have those three people in a group and let them debate it <laughs> and I want to hear the reactions of the people who are talking about their thing really vehemently I want to know who they think who's the craziest out of the two of the other people and just ask them all of it and just see who really thinks who's the craziest <laughs> just I want to see how devoted these people are to their religion and who they think is crazy because it's really gonna be a good tip to know what those people think are crazy because when they start backing away I'll already be 20 feet away but it'd be a good um, determination factor for that uh, if you want to know about the Zanalian people or whatever the creation with the aliens uh, you can just watch the creation episode creationism episode of of uh, Penn and Teller and you'll be able to um, hear what he actually says and it, it honestly would be fun to see like I want to know the religion that Christianity goes I'm back in the fuck away cause you're crazy it's really funny I, I want to see that it, it's just really funny that like people who find their story re really true and then they hear someone whose like other creation story is different, and they just go, "That guy is insane." Like, like when Christians say, "Oh, you evolution and science people are fucking out of your mind," and they try to explain why everything's the way it is, and it's just fun watching them trying to stutter their way through their own main points when you're just di dissecting their arguments with a laser scalpel and just picking it apart. And yes, I honestly know that I stutter sometimes, but that's because I'm trying to get a point across or I'm pissed off or I'm tired or there's factors why I stutter sometimes. I don't stutter all the time. And mind you, this is all one take, so fuck you. <laughs> but, um, no editing. But, um, yeah, it would just be really fun to know what religion uh, Christianity thinks is crazy, and what and what Scientology religion, what people in Scientology think, which religion that's crazy to them. Because Scientology is out of their fucking minds. <laughs> if you honestly believe the shit that they probably say in Scientology, with the whole nuking people nuking aliens and their souls are in you and you gotta get rid of them if you believe that shit you're clinically insane um just saying I'm not a Scientology scholar I don't read Scientology literature just because I don't want to have my fucking brain explode by the insanity of it all but um I don't know. I just it's it's it would be funny to know what the various religions thinks is crazy when they themselves are out of their fucking minds. Um. Uh. It's just really funny talking to someone. Like I want to talk to someone who believes in creation like wholeheartedly, like they believe that the Genesis is the direct word of God, and then ask them what laws of the Bible they actually. Uh, don't say like they don't hold the. Not, uh, I did a video about this where I said, um, "How can you uh, say the Bible is literal, but you take away other laws that you don't like?" And I'm saying like, "How can I want to talk to a person face to face 
through YouTube, Plog TV, or uh, stick ham, something, so that way we're face to face or meet in person, face to face, and say, yeah, you believe cre uh, creationism is the real way everything happened. It's in the Bible. That's what you believe. The Bible is right on that. It's like, then what laws of uh, God do you omit? What laws do you omit? If the, if the Bible is the word of God. Why don't you enforce all the rules in the Bible? It's a question. I want to have that kind of discussion with these people, just to know what law, what uh, lines they draw in the Bible, and I just want to know that. Um, so, if you're a creationist and you want to have a one-on-one -on -one discussion with me, face to face, make a video, post it as a comment to this uh, response to this video. Um, and we can have a dialogue because I want to know what what your interpretation of the Bible is and what you take out of the Bible, what you leave into the Bible, what you practice, what you don't practice, that kind of stuff because it's really, I want to know. So, okay, point of this video, long-winded as, long as it may be, is I want to put three people of a different religion really hardcore people who really believe this into a room and see what the other people think of the other religions and see if who thinks who's really insane um, and if there's a creation person out there creationism person who really wants to have a, a dialogue with someone who considers themselves a science guy uh, and believe me I haven't really upped on my science in a while because I haven't thought of it but I will um, and don't ask me about thermodynamics because I'm not a thermodynamic person I don't know but general questions I'll be able to field but um, yeah if there's a creationism spokesman they consider themselves and you want to have a discussion with someone who's an atheist and have a discussion about you, the Bible and things like that post a video response and we can have a dialogue all right. peace love harmony and you know I all love I love you all in a totally non-gay way <laughs> all right peace